Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Headcrab Entertainment. I am TRP Strife, and this is Unepic. Joining me today is my silent co-star, Cabal. Okay, this pit kind of sucks. There's not a lot you can do at first. You got vines coming in from both directions and two dragons. It's just not a good start. Okay, looks like they managed to kill Cabal too. Here we go, Kamikaze! Whiff, whiff, whiff. <laughs> Jeez, I suck. Uh, I hate these things so much, they won't let me jump. Eventually we're down to just the two ice dragons which were both on the same side, which made it just a matter of jumping and shooting arrows. At least until the unthinkable happens. Dun dun dun. Lag spike. Yep. And that would be a dead me. Eventually, we do get past the dragons. And discover a room with two more. If I had any idea what I was doing, I would lock on with my bow, stay up on that ledge, and just fire away. But nope, I'm still not aware that there's a lock on button. Hard to believe, huh? I think I'll let Cabal play with that dragon. Whoopsie. Oh well, moving right along. Herp. And let's not forget. Derp. On a lower level, you see at the end of a hallway you spot a rat man. That doesn't sound right. Ha, a big of a rat is you. Me? What do you mean? You give us a handful of shitty treasure, you never place any cool chests, you are a bit of a rat. How many chests do you think people line up next to their own excrement? <laughs> Dude, you don't have to be realistic to an extreme. For stupid baseless arguments and incoherent situations, go play a video game. This is a tabletop RPG, use common sense instead of button mashing. He's a rat man with a green hood, smaller than you guys, and he has a barrel with a fuse on his back. Make shit pipe bomb. Is it alone? There's not four green tortoises with the rat man? Nice. Uh, I just love this game's sense of humor. Okay, I'll just pull this. Um. Um. You. No, I tried. Hmm, looks like he's having fun. And he stole the save point. Okay, there's a lot of frogs here. And it's because they fell through the ceiling when Cabal pulled the lever on the right hand side of the screen. There you go, killing the last one makes a ladder appear. Which leads to a fun bit of platforming. Both sides of the top level lead to a dead end, so there's no point in checking those out. Okay, looks like we got two ice dragons. Ah, oh, I thought there was only one. This could be fun. Okay, right there. Something happened. And I'm now suffering small poison damage. Okay, so it turns out it's a leech in your inventory that's... Sucking your blood. A few feet above your head, you see a great drainage pipe. Yes, but you notice that this pipe serves as a makeshift shelter for a timid Gurkai. What the hell's a Gurkai?
Hi, ass. Hey, Gurkha, here it is. Typically conjured by a sorcerer, creature that watches and hides a secret entrance, only recognizes its creator and allows access through invisible entrances, keeps treasure hunters and intruders at bay. And yes, he clearly won't recognize us. You mean kill it? Of course they mean kill it. What else are we going to do? You realize that while he hides in the pipe, you won't be able to attack him. He occasionally sticks his head out so to spy on you, only then will you be able to attack. In other words, this is really going to suck. Okay, the general idea, go up the ladders, get up to the top, and leap off and try to kill the Gurk Eye, or Gurk Eye, or Ass Eye, or whatever eye it was. Here we are at the top. Nothing up here, but a hole that we can jump down. And whiff. Not too big of a surprise, you get used to that on this part. Okay, so we've backed up to where the uh, two ice dragons were and the poison slug thing. This is an entirely optional area, but there is some pretty good loot at the end of it if you want to go through. And I think I'll just sneak right on past this guy, like so. Well, okay then. It seems this room specializes in raining blue frogs on your head. Epic skills. Alright, just a couple of torches to light, and onwards we go. And there goes Cabal. And there I go after him. Alright, made that jump. And we got a lever. And another lever. And another one, so three in total. This ought to be fun. I smell a trap. Okay, I can't resist. I gotta know what the levers do. If I can climb up the damn ladder. Alright, where's Cabal? Oh, okay, there goes Cabal. I'll just pull- oh shit, run, run! Damn it. Yep, definitely should've let Cabal do that. Okay, moving right along. Let's see, we got a zip line here. A ladder as usual. Alright then, let's see. Got a zip line here. And another zip line here. Oh shit. Ha! I knew that wall was fake. Hmm, nothing like a dark tunnel leading to a ladder. A really long ladder at that. Okay, we made it. This is the optional looting room, or the first one at least. Bunch of breakables, all sorts of good stuff. Alright, so the barrels have arrows, but there are chests behind them. Always good. Love my loot. You come to a castle room, it appears to be some sort of weapons repository. This could be good. But yeah, no magic here. Mages live on the top floor of the towers. Don't know, maybe they like rooms with a view so they can jump and fly away. But the fact of the matter is they... Uh, whatever. Anyway, it's not the mage quarters, but it's a good place to start looting. Okay, up the ladder. Got a door.
The room up above has a nice blue glow. That's a good sign, right? Would probably be a better sign if I could actually stay on the ladder. But here we go up here. A bunch of breakables. A couple boxes. And some uh, magic tomes just laying out. Er, scrolls, not tomes. Before you lies a series of bookshelves full of dusty old books. What spells have we found? You rummage around but find nothing but old philosophy and literature books. Absolutely nothing on magic. Great, we found the scribe's room. Okay guys, that's it for the scribe's area. Time to head back to where the Urk Eye, or whatever it was, is hanging out. Catch you there in just a few. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the show, and I'll catch you in the next episode of Headcrab Entertainment.